Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another Dokkan battle video. So, a few hours ago, they released this little video on the official JP Dokkan Twitter page that gave us some pretty interesting details about the future of the game. So, in this video, we're going to quickly go through everything together so that you guys are fully up to date about what's happening, right? Now, I'm not going to be playing the video in this video just to avoid any copyright issues but essentially they start off by quickly going over the mini Dragon Ball Super superhero movie celebration that just happened on JP with the uh, new story event, the free to play Gohan and also the ticket banner and then from there I believe they go into a summary of the new update that JP just got and also talked about the fact that in the near future or maybe not like super near future, maybe later in the year, there's going to be a pretty big overhaul or revamp of the story mode. And I don't know if that means that the entire story mode is going to be reset or anything like that, but there's going to be some big changes happening to the story mode and Dragon Ball Story. And apparently there's going to be exclusive items that are only available in the story mode, I guess, to incentivize people to do it more, right? So that's pretty exciting. And last but not least, they revealed that uh, basically the Dragon Ball Super celebration, which a lot of people were expecting to happen, you know, relatively soon, like the, the real Dragon Ball Super superhero celebration, right? Um, it's going to be pushed back a little bit. And the Ten of Bata celebration for this year, the theme will be uh, Future Saga instead of Dragon Ball Super Superhero, like a lot of people were expecting. So I think the reason they did this was to avoid any outrage that would have occurred if, you know, a lot of people were expecting Tanabata, which is happening next month, right? To be a superhero theme celebration, and then it doesn't happen. You know, people might be upset, right? But now they make this video, they tell everyone, look, don't expect a superhero celebration this soon. We're getting it ready. It is happening, but just not right now. Now, as far as a future saga themed kind of battle celebration goes, I don't know about you guys, but I'm pretty excited for it because the future saga has been pretty long overdue, in my opinion. And, uh, you know, there's a lot of potential for some really, really exciting characters as far as summonable ones goes. Obviously, you gotta have a new Vegito, right? New Vegito Blue. Possibly a Goku and Vegeta that fuses into Vegeta, we'll see. And uh, maybe a new Rose, maybe a new um, Trunks, right, with the, the Sword of Hope. And what else? I don't know, there's just a lot of options. Obviously a new Zamasu is possible. And uh, to be honest, I'm maybe even more excited for the Extreme Sea Awakenings that could ha uh, come from this celebration, right? I mean, some. Uh, obvious examples would be the Tech Vegito Blue, which has to get an EZA for this celebration, along with the STR Rose, which was the counterpart on his Duel Dokkan Fest. And uh, I think there's a pretty high chance, a very, very high chance, that the Tech LR Rose and Zamasu, you know, the final um, OG5 lead, the final, you know, original 90% lead, is going to be getting. Their Extreme Sea Awakening. And then, I mean, this might be a bit of a long shot, but I think there's, you know, somewhat of a chance, you know, a, a small chance that this guy too, the Int LR Rose, will be getting an Extreme Sea Awakening. Now, I'm not going to be expecting that, but these three, I'm definitely fairly confident that they will be getting easy gays, and that alone is enough to get me very, very hyped for this future saga celebration happening for Tanabata this year. So I don't really mind the fact that we have to wait a little bit longer for the superhero celebration. Honestly, I would much rather that they take their time and not rush it and give us some more events, some more content for this, you know, legit superhero celebration instead of, you know, just coming out with like a mediocre one if they weren't really fully prepared to release it, right? And in terms of the, you know, timeline for that, 
many people are now speculating that it's gonna be for the worldwide celebration, which makes a lot of sense, because, um, you know, they wanna kind of benefit from, uh, benefit from the hype of, like, the global release as well, right, of the movie, and I forgot exactly when it was coming out, but it's gonna be in late, wait, hold on. I should look that up, but maybe August <laughs> sometime, like close to around when the Worldwide Celebration would be anyways. Um, I could be wrong about that, so don't hold me to it, I gotta look that up. But the point is, it makes sense for the movie celebration to be a joint celebration between Global and JP to maximize the hype globally for the movie, right? So um, yeah, it, it's all making sense to me. Uh, I don't mind it, let me know in the comments down below how you guys feel about it, but regardless, future Saga celebration, something I've been asking for, I've been waiting for, for quite some time, it's finally going to be happening, can't wait to see what this guy does, he's going to be insane, this Rosé will be very good, these guys are probably also really impressive, and this dude is going to be getting like 20 mil attacks that <laughs> after his EZA, because right now he's putting up like you know, 10 mil or so. Um, so with an easy A, we'll see what he does. I mean, of course, the most important thing is that he gets some more defense. That's key, he needs the defense. But um, yeah, he should be really good as well. So I am, I'm stoked, guys. I don't really even, okay. No, it's not fair to say I don't care about the summonable units that come from this. I do, obviously. If it's a new Vegito, it's, you know, been some time. So definitely, gonna be good but um yeah the easy a's are really where my mind's at right now for the celebration so uh guys that's gonna do it for today's video thank you so much for watching hopefully you're stoked for the future saga tanabata celebration as well and of course we have the dragon ball super superhero celebration later this year hopefully for the worldwide celebration maybe not we'll see and uh, as always if you liked today's video then make sure to like the damn video sub to the channel if you're new hit that notification bell so that youtube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content and uh, until next time have an awesome awesome day i'm tiger with tiger uppercut media signing out <laughs>